Hey there! Today we are going to be learning about how to measure time. And at the end of this lesson, you should be able to name the instruments for measuring time, state the metric units of time. Now let's begin. What is time? Time is what we use to see how long it takes to do something. For example, if you are waiting for your turn to play on the swing, you can know how long you waited for the person to come down by checking the time. There are two methods of measuring time, the olden method and the modern method. Do you know how old methods of checking time are? In the olden days, people used different things to know what time it was. They used the sounds of certain animals. They used hourglasses. They used water clocks and also candle clocks. They sometimes used shadow clocks. But those were in the olden days. We now have more than methods of checking the time. These methods include using a pendulum, using modern clocks, for example, wall clocks, wristwatches, and stopwatches. We can also check the time on a mobile phone or on a computer. We usually start counting time using seconds. We count seconds like this. One, two, three, four, and so on. It's easy to count seconds. But did you know, when you count up to 60 seconds, it becomes a minute? Yes, 60 seconds make one minute. And 60 minutes make one hour. 24 hours make one day. This means that the time from midnight to morning, to afternoon, to evening, and then night again takes 24 hours. And those 24 hours make one whole day. Did you know that there are seven days in one week? They are Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and Saturday. Saturday and Sunday are weekends, so we don't have to come to school. There are four weekends in a month. Do you know what that means? It means four weeks make one month. Finally, 12 months make one whole year. It sounds like a long time, right? That's why we celebrate the new year only once in a year. We have now come to the end of the lesson. Did the class take a long time? Did you learn anything new? Now let's go over the lesson one more time. Time is what we use to see how long it takes to do something. There are two methods of measuring time, olden method and the modern method. In the olden days, people used different things to know what time it was. They used the sound of certain animals, they used hourglasses, they used water clocks, they used candle clocks, and they sometimes used shadow clocks. But now, we use things like pendulums, wall clocks, wristwatches, and stopwatches. We can also check the time on the mobile phone or on a computer. We usually start counting time using seconds. We count seconds like this. 1, 2, 3, 4, and so on. Remember the units of measuring time? 60 seconds make 1 minute. 60 minutes make 1 hour. 24 hours make 1 day. 7 days make a week. 4 weeks make 1 month and 12 months make 1 whole year.